plan for multi-cloud, even if you don't intend on using multi-cloud today. That will help you make better purchasing decisions when you're making a purchase of a tool, for example. It'll help you make better training decisions for your engineers. It'll help you better make better automation and governance and security decisions. So what we want is when we're going out to buy a tool, we want to make sure that there's feature parity for the primary cloud provider. But we also want to make sure that the same tool will give us the same feature capabilities for the second cloud provider, for the third cloud provider. Again, even if we don't intend on operationalizing these cloud providers today, I identifying the secondary cloud provider or even the third cloud provider today is important because now we're making better decisions. The last thing you want is to end up with tool sprawl, where you've made a purchase of a, of a tool, but then when you went to operationalize that second cloud provider, you realized there's no feature parity or there are features that are missing. Now you have to invest in a second tool. So we want to avoid this type of a scenario.